Welcome class to how to set up an online portfolio. This video will aid you in completing your weekly tracking logs and the $100,000 stock market project. The first thing you need to do is log on to Google Finance. If you do not have a username, you need to create an account. If you do have an account, you're going to log in with your email address and your password. Upon coming to the home page, you're going to click on Portfolios. The computer will prompt you to enter the name of your portfolio. For the purposes of this, we're going to type in Mr. Gurney's stock project. After clicking on Mr. Gurney's stock project, we will have the opportunity to deposit cash. And we're going to deposit $100,000 on the day that we're purchasing the stocks in our account. Just as we would in real life, we would actually have to bring a check or cash to a brokerage to deposit before buying stocks. Once we have our $100,000 in our account, we're now going to purchase stocks. It's very important that we click on the Add Transaction Data button, not the previous button about adding a symbol. So Add Transaction Data, and we're going to buy our stocks at this point. The first stock I'm going to buy is Google. And I'm going to put the date that I purchased the stock, as well as the number of shares. I'm going to be buying 40 shares of Google which costs $495 per share. And as you can see, I, it, Google has a market value of $19,383, and I, I now have $80,200 left to spend. I'm going to buy five stocks and spend roughly $20,000 on each. The next stock I'm going to buy is McDonald's. And similar to the Google trade, I'm going to be purchasing it on the same day. And due to the fact that McDonald's is a lower price, I'm going to be able to buy more shares. I'm going to be buying 375 shares of McDonald's at a price of 57.62. And I'm going to click the Add to Portfolio button. We're going to want to do this for every one of our stocks at which point we will have five stocks and some cash remaining. If you have any additional questions, please see me in class or watch this video again.